everyone. Um, welcome. This is going to be the yarn creators video. So there's been a tag going around, which no one's really tagging anybody, but it is a video to show the viewers, you subscribers, um, some of the people that we have been watching and to just give them a little love. Um, also the parameters, a lot of this started because of the um, monetization parameters on YouTube changing, um, which this may piss people off, but I completely understand. I mean, you have to reach a certain amount in your account before AdSense even pays you. So for some of these smaller YouTubers who have money sitting in an account, it's basically like a cat, a check that someone's writing to you, but they haven't cashed in months. So that money is just sitting there, not being used by the person that they're sending it to, and they can't really take it back. It's just money that's just sitting there being sitting there. So I completely understand why the parameters are the way they are. Now, some people may be losing an income. Um, so the parameters are you have to have 4,000 watch hours, not minutes, hours. And you also have to have 1,000 subscribers to even be considered for monetization. Now, some of the people I'm about to list, probably, um, they may want to monetize their videos. They may not want to monetize. Um, but everybody on this list has less than 1,000 subscribers. They are crochet and some knitting podcasts. Um, so this is yarn creators. So I am not being biased in doing just crochet channels. Um, there are some knitting channels in there as well. Um, so to get started, every name I say, I'm going to put either something here or here or here or across my face. I don't know, but I will put their name and all the links to all the channels will be below. So to get started, um, we have Addie Day Designs. Now this is a knitter, knitting podcast, I believe. She also is the person behind Addie Day Designs, like knitwear, I believe. And I'm not sure if she's a yarn maker or not, but Addie Day Designs, Blue Heart Crafts. Um, so like I said, total side note, I know I'm like getting off topic, but these are all the people that I subscribe to. I'm not doing shout outs to videos or subs like channels that I don't watch personally, just because I, I, I don't know, it just doesn't sit well with me telling you guys to go subscribe to a channel that I don't even watch. These are all people that I watch that are on my subscriber list. Um, so, and I think you can even see all my subscriptions on my account so you guys can see everybody I subscribe to. Um, so anyways, let's get back to it. So the last one was Blue Heart Crafts. The next one is Cam Cab 147, Candy Goss Creations, um, Chevy Rel. Now I will give you a little heads up about Chevy Rel's podcast. She likes to cuss. Although I love it, I love how down to earth she is and totally chill. Like she is someone I would totally freaking hang out with on a day to day basis. Um, but yes, I just wanted to preface that that um, she does curse. So if you don't like that, you probably won't like her channel. Um, but she is a knit crochet channel. I should probably say that if they're crochet or knit. So if you don't like knitting, you can skip. If you don't like or if you want to stick with just crochet, you can do that too. Dear Designs is a crochet podcast channel. Um, Emma Escott of the Lulu Loves podcast is a crochet channel. Um, we have Evan Gaze Crochet. It's in the name. <laughs> um, French Fried Crochet. She likes to do a lot of stuff that is like 80s. So I've seen Care Bears. I've seen Trolls. You know, and not like the new trolls, the older trolls. So, yeah, she's super cool. Check her out. And she likes to do giveaways a lot. So, yeah. Um, Gina Fiorito. I am probably butchering that. Um, but she is a knitting podcast. And she is fairly new. Gussets and Got It's. 
Um, that is a knitting slash sewing slash a little bit of everything, I believe. Um, then we have hand-me-downs, crochet, and knit. This man, he's an older man who lives in, um, oh my gosh, I can't remember now. He's in the UK. He's in uh, the continent of England. Um, but I love watching his podcast because yes, he goes into, you know, the crochet and the knitting and stuff like that, but he also gives you like snippets of trivia. So on one podcast he was talking about during world war, I can't remember if it was one or two, but how men would knit and, um, someone's at my door men would knit as well as women and it was like a combined effort for the nation to knit and send it to soldiers and then there was um talking about love and just all kinds of cool stuff <laughs> sorry about that um so yes check him out he is super cool um next is hooked on owls lacy um she is a crochet channel with some knitting as well um hooked by happenstance this is kendra she is crochet heavy so a very crochet heavy um channel and she does a lot of different videos um i think she said she tries to post three times a week so it's not just a podcast she also does other kitschy type things with crochet so she's also one to check out i'm yarn inspired um she's a crochet channel jen clifton she is a crochet i'm not no, knitting diy type channel um she's an older woman uh, older lady i don't i hate saying older but she's older than me so technically it's true she also lives in virginia um we have happy to hook creations that is a crochet heavy podcast as well um then we have love charlie crochet in the name mad fuzzy podcast she is a knitting podcast um melody crochet mickey midge she her name is michelle she lives in the uk so hers is very crochet heavy she has a podcast um, no catchy name crochet talk with Ella. She has a very crochet heavy podcast as well. Um, now this person is very new. She only has one video and four subscribers, but her last video was last week. Her name is Pam Wilson. Um, <laughs> she's a crocheter and she films her crochet podcasts in her car before work. <laughs> um, so yeah, you may want to check her out. It's up to you. Um, Patty Mac Knits. This is a newer knit. I don't know how new. I don't want to say new because I don't know. Um, this is a knitting podcast, which she also likes to show some of her baking. Um, Randoms Randy. Ra oh, tongue twister. Randy. Ran no. <laughs> Random Randy's Ramblings is a crochet podcast. Um, Ruthie Pink Pumpkin, also a crochet podcast. Um, Sam Squeaks. This is another person who's very new. She has, I believe, only two videos up. Um, next is String Theory Podcast. This one is also very new. One episode. Um, I found them like last week and I think they are doing monthly videos. So yes, they are crochet and knitting. Both of them can crochet. Both of them can knit. I think one prefers the other over the other, but I don't, I'm not completely sure because it is the first one. So I have more to watch as they go along. Um, next one is thread of love. Now this, one is not a new channel but they haven't really posted much lately so just be aware of that some of these i have subscribed to some of them are 
very new or are going full steam and some of them have kind of slowed down if not stopped because it's been a while so that one is one that has kind of slowed down or and or stopped i don't know um she hasn't made a video in quite some time but it is someone that i've subscribed to that has less than a thousand subscribers so yes next one is totally lee.net um she's in australia she is a crochet i don't want to say it's a podcast because it's kind of like a catch up with me like hey see what i've been doing and they're normally 15 20 minutes the most um but she makes amazing she calls them photo gans because they tend to be a people oh my god freaking amazing she um the last one she did was i think carrie grant if memory serves me she did carrie grant and she was working on someone else that she started Oh my gosh, you guys need to check them out. It is insane. Or check her out. She's insane in a good way. The craziest insane of the best ways. If that even makes sense. It doesn't, but whatever. Um, World Peas 00 Knits. So this is a knitting podcast where she also likes to show what she's gardening and stuff like that. And I love um, but <laughs> This year I won't be able to because we will be moving midsummer, so I don't want to get crops going to leave them behind. So, and I don't know if the person that's going to live here next wants the maintenance and the upkeep and all the work that goes along with gardening fruits and vegetables and stuff. So, yarning with the Hadlock girls. Um, they have not made a video since December, I believe. Um, I know their family was heavily, heavily affected by the shootings that happened in Nevada because both of their husbands are um, police officers and were there in the line of fire, basically, dealing with that. So I don't know if they're still on a break because of that or, but they haven't made any videos lately um last but not least is the yarn joy podcast which is crochet oh yarning with the hadlock girls is a crochet and knit podcast um yarn joy podcast is a crochet podcast um and that is it that is all well not all of them those are just the ones with under a thousand subscribers so there is quite a few so I will leave you with that. You can check them out. All the links will be below. If you decide to subscribe, great. If not, great as well. I don't want anyone to, to go and say, I need want you to subscribe to these channels. Like, you watch what you want to watch, and I will watch what I want to watch. All right. I will see you guys later. Bye.